Now with the area's certified most accurate forecast seven years in a row, meteorologist Chad Raiflisberger. Lots of sunshine on this Friday afternoon. A look outside on the Storm Team 5 Sky View camera. Powered by Pella Windows and Doors of Wisconsin. Oshkosh 24 degrees. Look at all the people out on Lake Winnebago right now taking advantage of this nice weather here as we wrap up the work week. Blue skies in Appleton, 27 degrees. Lots of dry conditions here on College Avenue. And we're looking at the sunny skies here in Green Bay as well. 24 at the airport. Feels like 11 with a south wind at 16 miles an hour. So those wind chills will be a little bit cooler once again this afternoon, despite the warmer air, where we will likely have highs in the low to mid 30s uh, across northeast Wisconsin. But with the southwest wind at 10 to 20 miles an hour, some higher gusts, it will feel just a touch cooler with those wind chills. 33 at the moment in Clintonville, already up to 34 in Shinewell, 35 up in Mountain. And how about this? Approaching 40 already up in Iron Mountain. And again, we are dealing with these southwest winds upwards of 26 miles an hour. That's just a sustained wind in Watoma. So it is quite gusty and it will remain that way as we head through the overnight hours. Uh, your forecast here for those winds showing 10 to 20 miles an hour, even into the evening and overnight. And especially this afternoon, we could easily have some gusts over 30. Now, pretty quiet weather expected here the next seven days. So I want to show something a little bit different here today. This is called the Winter Severity Index. This is a product developed by the Midwest Regional Climate Center. Essentially, it takes into account temperature, snowfall, and snow depth, adds that together, and then gives us an idea of just how severe our winter is has been. So this is for Green Bay. This black line is kind of a tally of our score so far this year. So you notice we're kind of in this orange to yellow area. That's a moderate to average winter season so far. Our temperatures have been fairly warm and we've seen some snow that's kind of added up those points. And these blue lines are a projection of what our season could end up based on five similar seasons compared to the score that we have right now. Now compare that to Marquette, Michigan, they're in the extreme category right now, likely due to all the snow that they have picked up so far this season, giving them quite a few points on this index and those five projections as well. Kind of keep them in that severe to extreme category as well. So something kind of neat to look at here this afternoon as our weather is pretty quiet. Still a foot of snow on the ground here in Green Bay, uh, just over 20 inches in Wausau and nearly three feet of snow on the ground up in Marquette. Now right now, clear skies. You can see all the snow here on the visible satellite. You can really see the ice on the Bay of Green Bay as well. And we have a huge area of high pressure off to our south. There's barely anything going on across the nation right now. A little rain well off to our south and east. A few clouds here later on tonight. Maybe a passing cloud or two, but lots of sunshine for your Saturday. And we'll keep that trend going into Sunday with maybe just a little more cloud cover. So your forecast for the rest of today, plenty of sunshine, a little chilly with that breeze, but it will be warmer with highs in the upper 30s across the Northwoods. The rest of us in the low to mid 30s. And then for tonight, just a few passing clouds, low temperatures in the lower 20s. Your seven day planner it has a high near 36 on Saturday, lower 40s on Sunday. And then we'll be watching for a system. Looks like that will stay off to our south and east early next week with temperatures falling back into the upper 20s by Wednesday. For the latest forecast information, you can find that anytime on our website. That is wearegreenbay.com. It's amazing how just a couple of hours makes. When I went to work this morning and even 9 o'clock this morning, it was freezing. And now you go outside and it's sunshine and a lot warmer. Our cars will feel very nice here <laughs> in just know. a few minutes when we go back out there. <laughs> All right, thanks a lot, yeah. Chad. Well.